done incredible damage against right handed pitching this year. 838 OPS. In the air, short left field. That could be trouble. Drops yeah. in and bounds deeper into left field. And Nomar with a leadoff double. Now there's the trick with that turf. Fisher didn't want to dive for it because if you miss it, that thing's bounding who knows where. And you know it's going to bounce high. This is a good hustle double by Nomar Mazzaro. When this ball goes off the bat, you realize it's got a chance down, and you do not want to hesitate because you know it's going to take a high bounce. That's one of those things you talk about when you first get to this ballpark and say, watch the high bounces. Things like this can happen, and you, if you're hustling, you can pick up that extra base. 3 2. And this one flared into right field, a base hit, and Mazzara will stop at third base. Rangers with their third hit on this road trip with a runner in scoring position, but the second of those hits that does not get the run home. It's uncanny. The Shields right back in the lineup today after a ball game yesterday where he really banged into that fence in center field, and he smashes this one up the middle for a base hit. That gets Mazzara to the plate, and the Rangers have the first run of the afternoon. And it's really good to see him comfortable and drilling this ball up in the zone right back up the box. You see Delano getting the head out in front of that pitch, staying through the middle of the field. There was a good video that Fox Sports South West tweeted out with Calix Crab talking about keeping the barrel through the middle of the middle of the field longer. I think that was a good example of it there with Delano. Reed Foley with the 0-1, and there's a hard hit ball. Biggio to his right, slides to a knee, stabs it on the backhand, spins, stands up and throws to first to get Calhoun. Nice play by Kevin Biggio. Well, the ball hit just a little to his right, but it had uh, plenty of pace on it. But a nice play there by Biggio for the second out. But was released at the end of spring training, and that ball smashed into left field. One run is in. Delino will score into second base. Santana with a double. And those two runs make it 3-0 Rangers. Had two doubles yesterday and a big one here this afternoon. This ball was ripped off the left hander. He mentioned 18th double of the season, and Boshears goes to the fastball. A lot of curveballs from him. He threw a first pitch curveball for a called strike to Danny Santana, but this fastball right down the middle. It's hammered. Ground ball, right side. That one's through. Santana around third. He heads to the plate. Gritchick, his throw gets by the cutoff man. And the Rangers add a run. An RBI single for Andrews, and it's four to nothing. You know why the last two years he got off to a rough start in the second half. He's heated up. It's a high fly ball to right. His ball is carrying the wrong way. It's off the fence. Gritchick is headed around second. He's going to third. Mazar's running it down. He'll get it back to the infield, but Gritchick will end up at third with his third triple of the season. It looked like a lazy fly ball to right field, but that ball just kept moving away from Mazzara. There's the triple that Randall needed the other night for the cycle. He single doubled and Homer needed to triple this ball inside out, and it just kept slicing away from Mazzara, who missed time to sleep. Ground ball. Andrews to second for one, back to first, not in time, but it comes in to score. The Blue Jays are on the board. Pulling off pitches a lot. This one out to right field, and Mazzara lays out for it and makes a great headlong catch to Rob Guerrero. Two away. What a defensive series it has been for Nomar Mazzara. I know he struggled on that one that ended up being a triple, having a hard time finding the wall, but it's been a couple of really nice plays and a good job by Aller to jam. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. A fastball getting in on the big righty, and there goes Nomar with that nice head first dive. And this one down the right field line, fair ball, and into the corner. Santana has very good speed. They're going to wave him around third base. Here comes the relay throw from Biggio, not in time. And Santana scores on the Andrews double. It's five to one. Well, he continues to do it and use the opposite field so well. Does Elvis Andrews second RBI third hit of the day? That's an easy stand-up double, and they had no chance of getting Santana at home. Made his major league debut this all, this month, August the fourth versus Detroit at 21 
years old, 139 days. That's the second youngest American League peach, pitcher to make his major league debut this year. Of course, Elvis Luciano of the Blue Jays at 19 years old. The ball gets away. Here comes Hernandez. He slides in safely, and the ball is still being thrown around. Hernandez grabbing his back. I don't know if he got stepped on or got hit by the ball or what, but he is walking back to the dugout holding his right side. Base hit. Telez is going to score. Danny Jansen around first. He will stop there. And the Blue Jays are coming on. Danny Jansen second straight hit. It's a double here in Toronto. Mm. This ball's hit well. Deep out to right field. If it stays fair, it is gone. And that is a home run for Mazzara. Four seam fastball. And watch this thing just get crushed. Nomar took a quick look. Great reaction there from the catcher. Chance. And you see his hands go up. It's awesome. You got to love it. Oh, Bechette, a terrific play. Oh, my. That ball was in the outfield, passed him. He stayed with it, got to his feet, and throws a strike across the diamond. You know, one of the things that you've been impressed with with Bo is fielding, but his range, how he can get the ball to the baseballs. He gets the hands and the arm, very impressive. It sounds a little more fun up here. The loony hot dog. Yeah, loony hot dog night. High fly ball out to right field, and Gritchett chased back to the wall. It's gone. And Santana has homered to add another big insurance run for the Rangers. Let's see where they go with this one. It's a slider again in nearly the same spot. And Danny Santana goes from swinging and missing at this pitch to absolutely squaring it up. My favorite part here is as his ball was coming down, Josh Frazier, the bullpen catcher, wasn't sure what was going on. He bailed out. He kind of saw it. I think he lost it in the sun. Oh, Ramirez trying to get himself through the eighth is 2 2, and Elvis smashes it to third. Diving stop Drury from a knee over to first, and that one wide of the base. And Elvis with another hit, his fourth of the game. A 1 2. Yep. A swing and a miss, strike three. He gets Guerrero, and this one is over. The Rangers win it 7 to 3.